Welcome back everybody to my channel and today I'm gonna do a tutorial I've been thinking of doing for a long time and it's the scoreboard command. I know my, my channel is like full of commands but, but yeah that, we all like commands right? right? okay so so the scoreboard command is basically telling us how much like it's, it's like a score here's your score here's your score hit tab and there's your score so first thing we're going to do is we're going to type in slash give at p command block bam so the we're going to start out with the base command we're going to start out with slash uh scoreboard objectives add and this is basically what the scoreboard command is and remember hit tab to get the best option so then you want to name it so i'm gonna name my thing name just because because i want i, I'm, I want this video to be explaining and now here's the part you want to pick something that that there you go on a website just type in scoreboard objectives you click the minecraft wiki or whatever and they have a list of every single scoreboard objective but the most common ones are uh, kill counts mob kill count death count so for now i'm gonna switch this from name to death count and then you put death and it's gonna automatically do if you hit tab death count so it didn't add it yet but that is it so now i'm gonna grab a button real quick so we can add it so it, now it added the objective death count right here yay okay so so we can we can it's already added so bam next thing we're not seeing it so we're gonna have to do such scoreboard i mean scoreboard objectives uh, set display uh, now there's below name list sidebar and there's all these different sidebars that for t they're for teams but right now we're gonna do sidebar because that is it and then if you hit tab all of your things if you continuously hit tab if you made other ones they're gonna appear but for now it's gonna be death count and remember no spaces in your in your names of things and we hit bam now we're not seeing it yet because it doesn't have a reason to be there so it's not going to say zero so what i'm going to do here real quick is i'm going to dig my death hole not yet and i'm going to set my spawn point to right here so spawn point alex mentor and i'm just gonna jump in and die real quick i forgot to do this, the, the game rule but that's fine so bam my death count is one as you can see right here my death count has become one and yeah it's pretty cool it's awesome i'm gonna really quick game rule um uh keep inventory true and now we die and we can have it okay so now now we have this but how do we reset it scoreboard uh, uh, players um reset then you can do at p which is normally what you want to do if you're doing like a map and don't forget the uh name of the thing so now i reset it i reset the score i reset everything and we have this so what's gonna happen step one you add the thing step two you set the display step three you make a reset button okay but what's all the stuff with the team sidebar aqua well this is a pretty cool thing to do on servers so i'm just gonna reset real quick I'm gonna do this scoreboard um, teams add it let's just say team blue and we're gonna be I think it, yeah so it's we added team blue successfully 
uh, scoreboard. Um, not players, teams. No, not players, teams. Join blue. And I think. Oh, join at P. And then you have to do the selector. Have I, I have joined team blue. And I think there's one more. Let me see. Scoreboard. Teams. Option, I think. Blue. Color. So it's color. You can explore, explore these things, and then I'm just gonna make it blue because obviously it's blue. And I set the color. Okay, we have all these commands. I'm gonna review them, but quickly I'm gonna show you what these teams do. I'm gonna die. I should make a slash kill button actually. That should be useful. Now my name is blue right here, and it's pretty cool what you can do with these things, and what is super cool about these things is that if you grab a wolf right here, and I'm going to grab some bones, oh yeah, um, and a name tag, the name of your pet will be the, the color of your team. So, let's check, try this out. Oh. Wow. Wow. Nice move. That was super smart. I'm gonna just rename this to Blue. Such a nice name for a dog. And now his name is Blue. And if you're playing on a map with, like, stuff and... And then you see a dog, and it's like, oh, it's blue. It's it's Alex Mentor's dog because he's in the blue team. So let's let's just like chase the dog and try to find the information we need for the other team. Blah blah blah. blah. So let me just quickly make a, a slash kill. Uh, uh, command, so we can quickly do these things. So. I'm going to review the steps, and today, uh, we, this is a short video, just for fun, we covered how to do scoreboards, and a bit of the scoreboards, so I may, there's maybe, there may be a part two video to this, but let's just review anyway. So, I'm just going to quickly do this, bam, I died. First command is you add, it's objectives add, name of your thing, and then... The the, the 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 objective so death count player kills or you can look on the website then you want to set this display to anywhere you want then you want to have a reset button so that you can reset the thing you want then here's the team section you can add teams you can join teams you can, um, you can make the blue team blue, or whatever color your team is, whatever, and there are many settings, actually, just quickly, and then there's a slash kill command. So, and even my name appears in blue in the command blocks. So, I'm just gonna quickly come over here, and just on the normal, normal text bar, I'm going to just do scoreboard, teams, add, I'm going to make this list, I added list, and then I'm going to scoreboard, teams, join, list, Alex Mentor, so now I'm in the, I'm the list thing, and then now comes the part we've all wanted, so I'm going to do teams option so list then there's a collision rule the color the death message visibility the friendly fire the name tag visibility see friends friendly invisibles and then yeah so if you have this see friendly invisibles 
Oh, yeah, and I have to do true or false. So, I think this is, I think it work, may, it may work for, for, uh, for mobs too, but I'm not really sure. So let me just grab a bone real quick and I'll be right back. Uh, I'm back and I'm just gonna tame this wolf real quick and I'm gonna name him List. So, bam, we have a list right there. And as you can see, I can see him, even though he's invisible, because I'm on his team. Actually, he's on my team, because he's my dog. And I'm, I'm not, I'm not on this team anymore, so yeah. But now, uh, as you can see, I can see, I can see List, but others can't. If, if somebody's on blue team or yellow team or something, they can't see List. So... Let me just join the blue team because because I want to show you and I think I think he automatically becomes mine but yeah I I think I'm going to need another player for this but anyway you got the 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 main concept of the video, uh, sorry, I don't think I'm gonna put the commands in the description, even though it's really useful, but you can pause the video in the moment I'm typing the commands, so, right here, I have just shown how to make scoreboards, oh, make it, and next video is probably gonna be how to make dummy scoreboards, which are, like, scoreboards you can add and subtract to, uh, just manually, so if you want to have a parkour course, that at the end, it has something like a pressure plate, you finished, you get a point for this, it's a multiplayer server, yay, you're done, bam, bam, pressure plates, so, yeah, so there may be a part two to this video, uh, stay tuned for that part two, you might want to watch it, because scoreboards are super awesome, and remember, the internet is such a great resource. So if you want to know anything about commands, just search it on YouTube and there's gonna there's there's like almost a hundred percent chance you're gonna find something on there because YouTube is just full of like com great commands and stuff and you should really check it out. And don't forget to check out my friend DT Gameline's channel because I mean his videos are pretty cool. Watch our command wars, that's old but it's worth watching. It's worth watching me lose every time. People. Okay, so I'm advertising somebody else's channel. That's not bad or good, but. Thanks for watching. Like, comment. Actually, just, just if you want to, okay, people. Like, comment, subscribe, please. I need people. Subscribe to me. Okay, goodbye.